a 29-year-old University of Central Florida contractor was burned after chemicals reacted in a maintenance building on campus Monday afternoon. Orange County Fire Rescue responded to the incident at the employee-only building at 3512 Perseus Loop at about 3 p. M. Monday. The contractor was the only person in the environmental and hazardous waste building near the UCF Police Department building at the time. No students were involved or affected by the incident. That according to Orange County Fire Rescue spokesman Mike Jackals, the worker was transferring chemicals for disposal from a 50 gallon metal drum to a 50 gallon poly drum when there was a static charge. The result, a blast and a fire that caused significant burns to the man's upper body, chest, arms, hands, and face. He was wearing eye protection, which was probably a very fortunate thing, because he could have easily been blinded had he not had them on, Jackal said. The chemicals, he said, were a combination of different kinds of metal powders, including aluminum, magnesium and chromium, as well as other substances. Firefighters used a special fire extinguisher to put the fire out, which was burning likely higher than 200 degrees Fahrenheit at the time of the incident. By 4.30, the 50-gallon drum was outside the building, and the temperature had subsided to 130 degrees. The contractor was conscious and alert when he was transferred by Seminole County Fire Rescue to Orlando Health Medical Center.